This is the Kane Parkway Stormwater Management Pond in Newmarket. Well, it's easiest to think of there being two forms of phosphorus, one that's easy for the plants to feed on and one that's more difficult. What we're testing is a product called Fosslock, and if it works as hoped, it will reduce that easy phosphorus. If it's effective, we should see a noticeable reduction in the amount of weeds and algae in the bodies of water where it's applied. This is really exciting because phosphorus is a major concern for the health of this watershed. Water is drawn out from the pond, mixed in with the Fosslock granules and reapplied as a spray across the pond. Fosslock is a combination of two natural ingredients, clay and lanthanum. The Fosslock works by binding the phosphorus and essentially locking it out of the system. That phosphorus is now removed and no longer available for the weeds and algae to feed on. It's actually been tested around the world and here in Canada quite extensively for any harmful effects on humans or fish. So far all the tests have found no harmful effects at all. In fact, it's actually been used to treat drinking water reservoirs in both Australia and in Europe. Fosslock has been found to be very successful throughout the world and we have every confidence that we'll see that same success here. Well, the residents of the town of Newmarket and the town council have been trying uh, to uh, put the environment first for many, many years now. And for them, that means uh, addressing all of our environment, but specifically the East Holland River. And so this is an opportunity for Newmarket to partner with the Conservation Authority and to look at an application that on the ground can make a real difference to the watershed and to the residents' lives in this uh, community and in this area. It's exciting because it's innovative, it's a new way of addressing the problem. We're hoping we can achieve some real solutions from working in partnership with the Conservation Authority on behalf of the people of Lake Simcoe. The Conservation Authority is involved in a lot of interesting science and research. If people want to learn more about Fosslock or our other research, they should visit our website at www.lsrca.on.ca.